Now, President Uhuru Kenyatta today flagged off the first batch of trucks ferrying crude oil from Turkana County to the port of Mombasa, officially kick-starting Kenya's early oil pilot scheme. The president reaffirmed his commitment towards ensuring oil revenues are equitable, uh, equitably shared, I beg your pardon, between the locals and the national government. KTN's Abi Agena was in Lokichar and filed this report. Containers that would transport the oil to Mombasa. The symbolic gesture of Kenya joining the League of Oil Producing Countries came to life after President Uhuru Kenyatta flagged off the first consignment of crude oil at the Ngamia 8 well, marking a major milestone for East Africa. This flag off event and the anticipated implementation of the early oil pilot scheme marks the beginning of a long and fruitful journey. You come here to write another chapter of history. Sisi sasa tumeingia kwa hiyo ligi ya mafuta. A total of 2,000 barrels of oil will be trucked from Lokicha to Mombasa County for storage at the Kenya Petroleum Refinery. Transportation of the crude will see each truck carry about 150 barrels of oil. Local leaders have exuded confidence in the oil pilot program, which is expected to run for at least two years before Kenya can start commercial production of oil. We have this um, early oil uh, pilot project. As a country, it's really an achievement. We know with oil, we go far. We know our economy has been down, but now with this, the, the cost of living will start coming down. This is a day which we have long awaited uh, as a country uh, because it is historic. Uh, the first time ever this country will be exporting oil. We are having high hopes that the prices of uh, oil in Kenya will come down and um, economic def uh, growth definitely is inevitable. It is a good thing in the sense that now I think after some time it is going to help us even lower uh, the price of fuel, and this is going to you know, increase production in many ways. Huh? British company Talo Oil has been driving the oil exploration program for the last six years. The firm notes that the early oil pilot scheme is expected to give them an opportunity to conduct extended well testing to further test the quality of the oil, as well as bulk stock the crude for export. A crucial milestone uh, for the world's the fuller resource and the development of the country. Together we've received, achieved so much, but we have a long way to go. Kenya's crude oil under the pilot scheme will not see the government generate any revenue until 2021, when full field development is scheduled to start once an oil pipeline is built. Although discovery of oil in Trukana County signals fresh hopes for many residents of Trukana, who stand to secure jobs and better infrastructure. There have been simmering tensions around how revenues from the oil resource will be shared. Katika hesabu ya, ya county government, bado iko hesabu ya kila mwananchi ambaya naishi kwa county hii. Kwa hivyo mimi ni shukurani kubwa zaidi kwa jambo hilo ambalo liliondoa ile mzozo kubwa ilioko. Hizo hela zikiingia muanze kusema muatakamaji. Mwataka shule, mwataka stima, mwataka barabara, mwataka biashara zenu ziinuliwe. Lakini sio kusema atitugawe kespesa hii, atikila mutu achukue shilingi yake, aweke kwa mfuko yake. Well, after many years of marginalization, Trukana County is now on the global map, even as the first barrels of oil are set to be evacuated from Ngamia 8 here in Lokicha. This will be making a significant milestone for the oil production journey for Kenya, even as plans to set up an oil pipeline are in top gear. Reporting for KT News, I'm Abi Agina in Trukana County.